Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Java JDK 19 in Ubuntu operating system by the simplest way. First of all, just go to the Anywhere browser and here just type Oracle Java JDK. The first link is from the oracle.com. Open that link. Just open that link. This is an official version of the Java JDK. Okay. Here we find our the latest version of Java JDK. The now latest version is Java 19. So it is showing your Java 19. Scroll down. And here we find Linux, Mac OS and Windows. My operating system is Linux. We are going to install it on the Ubuntu. And Ubuntu is Debian package. Support Debian package. So we just go to the Debian package and just click at here at this link. Okay. Now our download is started. In few seconds, our download is completed. So be patient and wait for a few seconds. Now our download is completed. Just click on this folder icon. Okay. Here is the our installation file. Okay, now we want to check our Java is already installed or not. That is very easy and simple. Just type Control or T on our keyboard and our terminal is open. Now we just find Java, just Java version. Just type Java, hyphen hyphen version and hit enter key. And here we find Java is not fine. If you want to manually install it, or, or install it by the Ubuntu command line. We can install it by the OpenJDK. Just copy this command and install it. We are going to install it manually. That is very easy. So we just clear it. Okay. Now we just go to the here our setup file. Right click on the our setup file at here and just go to the open with other applications. Just go to the software install and select it. Now here we find Java JDK 19 and here we find install. Just click on install. Just add your Ubuntu password. Okay. Just add your Ubuntu password and just go to the authenticate. Okay. And it's take few minutes depending on the speed of your PC. So be a patient and wait for a few minutes. Now our JDK is successfully installed. Now close it. Now we just go to the terminal once again and I just type java hyphen hyphen version once again and it is also showing java is not found okay now we want to add a path then our java is successfully installed so that is very easy and simple first of all i just clear it okay now i just go to the our description just go to the, our description in the youtube or facebook okay and here i just give the path sudo opt, update alternative and install and we want to just want to change this path to our java path okay that is very easy first of all i just go to the here okay our downloaded folder or any folder and here i just go to the other location here i find computer just click on the computer in computer i just go to the user in user i just go to the lib in lib i just find gvm just find gvm here we find jdk and our version just double click on it okay now i just go to the bin folder in one folder the most imp part is java and java c so i just want to copy the path of this folder that is very easy just click at here or just type Control l on our keyboard and here we find our path right click on it and copy it okay now just go to the here and just paste this path at here here we just paste it on the our path paste it okay now we want to add a java so i just type java okay and i also want to change this path okay i want to add our path so right click on it and paste it and this type just type java c okay now just copy this first command from sudo to one just copy it from here just go to the here right click on it paste it and hit enter key okay now it is successfully changed now just go to the here from one to sudo also change for the java c copy it now just go to the, our terminal right click on it paste it hit enter key it is also changed now we just check java version is working or not java space hyphen hyphen version hit enter now 
here we find our java 19 is successfully installed we also check our java c is check change or not okay it is our compiler java c is also change it to 19 okay now i just clear it okay okay clear it now we want to set a java that is very easy and simple process okay now i just minimize it okay now i just minimize it and minimize it now i just go to the terminal in terminal i just add command i just queue this command in the description i want to environment file so i just enter it okay i just type my password enter it okay now here we find our environment i want to change the environment variable of our java form that is very easy just go to the this line is like this it is like this just go to the enter it okay and just give, go to the new line and just type java all in capital underscore home then equal double quote and in this double quote i want the path of my java okay that is very easy so first of all just go to the here file in file just go to other location in other location just go to the computer in computer just find user user lib just go to the lib lib in gvm just go to the gvm in gvm here we find jdk just go to the jdk and the your version number just go to the here and just click ctrl l on our keyboard and here we find our path our folder path right click on it copy it now minimize it now just go to the here just paste it here right click on it in between double quote okay now we want to save this that is very easy just go to the here save and save it now just close it close it from here now one second just go to the terminal i just want to clear it so i just type c l e r clear okay now we just refresh our environment variable that is very easy just give this command source etc environment and hit enter key on our keyboard now just type echo and dollar sign java underscore home and hit enter key and this give the our java jdk path and now we can use our java any java code that is very simple on this java environment variable i install java java path and java home now we are going to check our java is working or not that is very easy and simple i just go to the any text here i just go to show applications text editor in text editor i just create a new file in new file i just type some java code okay and just go to the here these three lines and just go to save as in save as i just save it on the desktop okay i just give any name i just give abhi and just type dot java i want to java dot java is important you can give any name and just click on the save now our is this java file is saved now we want to print this java file that is very easy here is the our java file and i want to print this okay now i just want to go to the terminal okay in terminal i want to go to desktop that is very easy i just go to the home at here i just go to the terminal type cd space then drag this desktop to here okay now go to the terminal hit enter key and we just go to the desktop okay now we just close it now we want to go to the abhi abhi java that is very easy we just type java space our file name dot java dot java hit enter key okay now it shows us a hello java not any error in our java file so guys this is the simplest way to download install java and also add java environment variable in ubuntu operating system and create our first java file and just print that java file or execute that java file 
on our YouTube ter our Ubuntu terminal by the simplest way. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share and comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you guys.